This is California Guardian. I'm out here with High Desert Community Watch and Team for Justice with Federal Corrections to Terminal Island on Terminal Island and the Port of Los Angeles and the Port of Long Beach. Uh, I think I believe, I'm pretty sure it's uh, considered San Pedro. Doing a First Amendment audit, seeing if the uh, Federal Bureau of Prisons, the Federal Correctional Institute at Terminal Island respects the First Amendment right to film in public. So it seems that here we have not only uh, Federal, Federal Correctional Institute, Terminal Island, but also the U.S. Coast Guard. So this is going to be not only a Federal Bureau of Prisons First Amendment audit, but also the uh, United States Coast Guard. Noise is cool in the background. Visiting.
So this person was driving down the street and made a U-turn and a came guard. back out. She's a guard. She's a guard? Yeah, she's got the uniform of a guard. Either a Coast Guard, because CSS Coast Guard this way too. Yeah. So she's either a Coast Guard or a correctional officer. You have to go in there to go to the Coast Guard. 380 yards. So this person over here is called security on us. One of the Audi. So as we see from the sign right here, we not only have Immigration and Customs Enforcement, we have United States Coast Guard and the Federal Bureau of Prisons at uh, FCI Terminal Island. So that's like the third or fourth time he's come around to see us. He is respecting our First Amendment rights. So at this time, it's still a pass. So as we keep walking, this Audi right here keeps uh, moving to different spots. So this Audi, every time we, uh, we walk away from the prison, this Audi moves. It's trying to stalk us, I guess, find out where we're parked. Not sure if it's a Federal Bureau of Prisons employee or a Coast Guard. So there she is again, peeking around the corner. She keeps moving. Look at that. She's slowly backing up around the corner. Trying to hide in her personal little Audi. So I don't know who this person is, but they're stalking us on public streets in their personal car. Hope they didn't have to report to duty because they're late to work. Now she's backing up down the street. I guess that's what they pay federal employees to do. So that white right Audi is still backing up down the street. All right. How are you doing? Not too bad. Make 
guys okay? I'm doing perfectly fine. What are you guys doing over here? I was just having a leisurely time uh, filming in a public space until that federal officer started harassing us. Okay. Well, I'm not harassing you. I'm just asking well, you. Well, I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about the uh, federal officer in the white uh, what actually Audi. What did she do? Well, she started following. We would walk. She'd follow us. We'd walk. She'd follow us. It felt like we were, our personal safety was at risk. So we started filming her. Did and then you we called the police? I did not. Well, I mean, if you feel I don't, like you're in safety. I don't need the police to protect me. Okay. All right. So we what attempted to make contact with her to ascertain her reason for following us, and then she back. She say she didn't. Uh, she back. She backed up all the way from uh, the fire department, all the way down here in the middle of the street. Backed up. Okay. Almost caused two different accidents. She almost caused two accidents. Well, do you mind putting the camera? You don't have to. It's your freedom of speech. But can you mind put the camera so I can look and kind of making me nervous a little bit? Do you mind? You're, uh, you're nervous with accountability. No, I don't, I don't, I don't mind that. Like I said, you don't have to. The first thing I told you, you don't have to. You said, do you mind? If you don't mind, put it down. If you do, then put it, keep it up. I prefer not to, uh, Sergeant Pittman. Sergeant badge, Pittman, yes. Badge number two five zero. Do you have a serial number? Correct. You can't be walking in the street. So I know you like to do the whole filming thing. You can't do illegal stuff while you're filming. What's All right, he's perfectly legal. What street? Where's there a sidewalk, sir? Just walk on, walk on the other side of the street. There's, there's no sidewalk over there. Walk on this side of the street. That's the point. There's no sidewalk over there, sir. He he, he, right, he was walking. Want? What do you guys want? Nothing. Nothing? You guys just want to be filming? You guys just want to be filming? Because you're not on a sidewalk, sir. You can challenge me all you want. Are you part of an organization? Is there something that you guys want? I invoke my Fifth Amendment, thank you. Okay, you guys are just out filming. All right, ma'am, you can go on. You're good. You're good, though. Yeah, I'm good. Thank you. I got an officer coming. Hey, sir, get out of the street. You cannot be in the roadway. I'll still be with the nice shot. Okay, yeah, it's not a problem. All right, how long you guys think you're going to be out here? Uh, I don't know. Just so we don't get multiple calls. I'm asking if you can help me help you. Well, I'll tell you, if you get phone calls, then probably the best bet is just to tell that's them... That's the only reason I'm here, because I got a phone call. Okay. So that's why I'm asking, how long are you guys going to be out here so I can give some sort of estimated time? Uh, I'm not sure how long we're going to be out here today. Okay, you guys are just out here filming people looking for attention. No, actually we're just out here filming, you know, there's uh, sea lions over there. And there's nothing illegal about that. That's not... You should ask her, we didn't call you. I get it, but you guys are trying to... I can tell by the way you're not quite... Most people I talk to, there's people who come take pictures. And like I said, there's perfectly legal. But the route that you guys are going, in my expertise, you're just looking for attention. Maybe you're not. Maybe you are. But from my expertise, that's what you're looking for. Why give it to us, then? Because I got a call. I have to respond to a call. You're not doing anything illegal, which is what I explained okay. to you. But when you have to respond to the call. I'm going to leave in a minute. I just asked this gentleman, hey, how long you guys think you're going to be out here? So if we keep getting the same calls... Because people don't always know the law. Well, I think it'd be fair something. enough, right? It'd be pretty obvious if you get another phone call, it'd most likely be us. So. I don't know that though. Like that's why I said, oh, if they're here all day, then they're here all day. Job security, maybe? For who? For me? Yeah. I got enough calls to go through, bro. Yeah. Like that's is why I say you guys are just trying to well, seem like well, you're trying to do. Well, it. That's I, fine. Do you guys need anything? Or you guys need any help? No. We're good. No, okay. we're good. If you're walking the street, that is against the law. All right? You can okay. challenge me all you want. If you keep walking in the street, I'm going to come back, and then I'm going to have to investigate. Right now, hey. you're not doing anything illegal. Hey, Sergeant Pittman. Fair enough? Sergeant Pittman. Fair enough. Yes, you have a question for me, sir? Yes, sir. If there's not a sidewalk provided, are you not allowed to walk in the there's gutter? There's no sidewalk provided on that side of the street. Only to that sign. Beyond that sign, there's no sidewalk, sir. Where are you how trying would to go? You get, how yes, you are. You can, you can get off into the street and then walk in the pathway. Yes. Thank you. That's what you're looking for. I just want to make sure that we don't... Uh, the jaywalk or community kind of traffic offense. Okay. You but, have any more questions for me? Yes, reversing down the street um, half a mile, is that a traffic offense? Driving backwards? I don't know what you're asking me. Well, shouldn't she have received a citation for her uh, reckless driving? No, I'm not giving her a citation for that. Oh. I didn't see it as reckless driving. That thin blue line, huh? That's what you want to call it. You have any other questions for me? No, nope, I think uh, your services are finished. Okay. You have any questions for me, sir? All right. You guys have a good day.
cop number two pulls up. So the the lady in the car was with the U.S. Coast Guard. Nice. Hey, what did he say? What did he say? I can take whatever I want, buddy. Nope. You got police coming. Good for you. Take some pictures here all. Good for you. I'll take whatever pictures I want. No. Nope. Yep. Over there, you can do that. Where? You Where? Can't take, you can't take pictures of this guy. Where? What terminal can I take? That terminal right there? 